Greetings, Harbor Springs Public Schools community. This is Michael Behrman, Superintendent of Schools. I hope that each and every one of you is relishing in the beauty that autumn brings, especially to Northern Michigan. We've been fortunate to enjoy some incredible fall days so far. It's hard to believe that we are already in our fifth week of school. That's given me some pause for reflection. I have to be honest with you. I approach this year with probably some of the same angst as you regarding the challenges of reopening school in the COVID-19 pandemic. Believe me, the challenges were many and still remain. There isn't one day of school this year that I take for granted. Having said that, I'm so incredibly proud of our students. They have risen to the challenges of wearing masks all day, sitting behind plexiglass, social distancing, and not being able to do some of the fun activities they are used to at school, and for many, adapting to online learning. I'm also proud of our parents for supporting their students, teachers, and administrators. It is a new normal for them as well as they adjust to not being able to walk their younger children to class or volunteer in the classrooms. Many of our parents have committed to being the learning coaches for their online students as well. And I am so proud of our staff. No matter their roles at school, I can assure you that each and every one of them is working harder than ever to make school safe as possible while ensuring that our students' academic and emotional needs are met. As you know, we recently had a positive COVID case at one of our schools. When there is a positive test at school, we work closely with the health department as they conduct contact tracing. If students of staff are identified as close contacts, they are quarantined from the last date of contact for 14 days. It is important that students, staff, and parents take quarantine orders seriously and comply in order to prevent further spread of the virus. It is also important that parents continue to screen their children for COVID symptoms daily prior to sending them to school. By following these measures, we achieve the goal that we all have, keeping school open. While there are definitely challenges that lie ahead for the remainder of the school year, we will approach these with cautious optimism, confidence, openness, and transparency. To that end, we are posting the most up-to-date COVID data and information on our website. And rest assured, if there are positive cases in our schools, I will communicate those to you in a timely fashion. And by the way, our fall sports teams are doing incredibly well. The football team is 2-0 and our tennis, soccer, and volleyball teams are off to great starts. So go Rams! Thank you and have a great day.